G'day YouTube, just to demo this pin nailer I bought. Uh, I did a video earlier just giving you a look at it, but I've actually um, tested it out quite a bit now. I haven't stopped using it since I bought it. I bought some quite long nails, they're about three and a half centimeters long, and um, I've, I've found a little rubber cap which I didn't know it had to. You put on the end of the where the nails come out, it basically stops the indent of damaging the timber. You just, you just got to get the pressure right, you got to sort of get the feel for how hard you got to hold it against the skirting or whatever. And um, then you don't even leave an indentation and the, the nails basically flush for the surface. So you don't have to putty any holes and um, you just paint it basically. Um, so this is a great tool. There's no gas with it, no bullshit. So it shouldn't seize up. Um, I've done hundreds of nails with this now. I'm really, really happy with it. Um, and I keep this in the car all the time now. I use it everywhere. See there, I pressed a little bit hard, a little bit of an indent there. That's a bit better. So that's generally the little, and you basically can't even see that once it's painted. And that's how uh, fine it is. It's just like a little pin going in. Even with the indents, um, you're not going to see that at eye level. Um, if, if you do press a little bit hard, you've got to have that rubber thing on though if you want to get it perfect. You use it without, you do get a little indentation there. Anyway, great product. I'd highly recommend um, you grab on it. What I will say is all these chippies that are out there using brad nailers and putting 4,000 nails in one little bit of skirting, it's totally unnecessary and it's just a pain in the ass for people like me. So stop being dickheads, go and buy a couple of pin nails, just keep them in the year. You just get a couple of air ones and um, they're nice and cheap. Yeah, I had to get the nails from overseas, but there's no need to create extra work for everyone else. It's just a pain up.